It's a homemade uh, well and well pump. Let you look at the handle. See that handle? Super simple. All made out of CPVC. Let me pull it out. Let you look at it. Let me tell you how it did the well. I took a two inch pipe, cut uh, teeth in the bottom of it, made a handle on the top of it, other end of it, opposite end of the teeth. Stuck a water hose in the middle of the pipe and just started twisting it and bored through the ground with it. Took a couple of hours. That was a couple of years ago. I didn't video that. That's a fern coat on top of it top of that two inch pipe. The inch and a half black pipe with a valve on the end of it so that so that it's got a valve on it, a check valve which lets water in. When you push down it uh, stops the water from going out. Let me pull this uh, homemade pump out and let you take a look at it. That's a coupling with a bushing on the end of it. It's a hole in there. There's a marble in there. It, it'll cover that hole. It'll cover that hole. So when you push down, the marble goes up and lets water in. When you pull up, it, the uh, marble goes down, holds the water. All right, CPVC, everything C, uh, CPVC, three quarter inch. All right, three quarter inch coupling, two of them. Took a piece of car tire, made it round on a grinder to, to fit that inch and a half black pipe. That way I can create suction and pressure. All three quarter inch. So that marble goes up, that marble goes up, and I've got a nail in here. And you can see the epoxy. So I got a, a nail epoxied in there. So it stops that marble from going too far up. So that marble stops here, and so it just, super simple, super, super simple. That's it.